This video will show you a really super easy, easy way to make the type of hat that is worn by a bishop or the hat that is worn by the pope. And I'll show you how to do it in a way that just takes a couple of minutes and it's inexpensive and it's really easy and it does the job. Now, why would you want to wear or make a pope hat or bishop hat? I don't know, maybe you are going to a costume party or a Halloween party or trick-or-treating or maybe you're going to a protest uh, against the church and you want to dress up as the Pope or a bishop uh, or who knows why. Or maybe you just think that you want to wear a silly hat and let's, let's face it, they are silly, silly hats and um, why should only old men wear, silly, wear these silly hats? Anyway, you get a piece of string or you can get a uh, tape measure and measure the circumference of your head just above your eyebrows and around the back and the brim to mine it came out to here so left to right that's going to tell you uh, how big or how wide across you've got to make your hat then I took a pencil and I marked that spot right where the you know, right where the width of my hat was and I drew the line straight on up okay so that took care of that part then I went halfway across and I measured that out. In my case, it was easy because the whole thing was about two feet across. Uh, and the, uh, so that meant, you know, one foot here, one foot over here. Uh, and this becomes the front of the hat. This one becomes the back of the hat. So that's easy and that's done. Then I moved on up here and I marked halfway across, which in my case, again, was easy because it was right here. Made a little dot. And then I came straight up and made a dot up there and finished this as a triangle. Now I made a sort of curved triangle, but you can make it straight if that's easier. It really doesn't matter. And then did the same over here. Took a simple pair of scissors, cut it out. That took just a minute. And voila, what do we have when we're done? We have a Pope's hat. Took a little bit of tape, so some adhesive tape to tape the edges right where they come together, which I'm trying to do with one hand while holding the camera. And as you can see, there is our Pope's hat or Bishop hat. And I put, it, or put one right here. And now you may want to draw something on it. You may want to accessorize it, or draw a cross, uh, or maybe you want to, um, you know, put a, you know, a message on it uh, like this. Um, if you're going to do that, I found the easiest way actually would be to print it out, print, print out whatever your message is on a simple piece of paper. Uh, just make the font size really, really large. Bend the edges so that they'll come up around. And with a little bit of tape, you can tape it to the inside of the front of your hat. And there you go. There's your hat with a message. Now, um, you'll want to accessorize this a bit. So if you get a black shirt, it could be, it could be a black t-shirt or a black button-down shirt. Uh, and now you'll think, well, I need to have a white collar. Well, over here, that's easy enough. With your scissors, you can cut off a piece of your poster board. Uh, and if you curl it around and put a little bit of tape on there, voila, you have a white collar. It's probably a little thicker than you need, but it'll this for demonstration will serve the purposes. You get the idea. There is your white collar. So now you've got your bishop hat, you have your white collar, you have your black shirt. If you have a little bit of white fabric or an old sheet that you were throwing out or was down in the basement, you can cut off a strip of that. A little fabric from the fabric store is easy. Uh, and voila, there you go. Now you have your black shirt, your white vestments. Uh, you throw in a Bible where you could mark your favorite crazy Bible verses. And if you want, you could even pick up for a couple of dollars a little bit of, a little bit of bling. And right there, there you go. There's your whole uh, outfit uh, for very inexpensive and it does the job. Um, now you could also purchase a um, priest costume or something like that, um, but really for simple purposes uh, this will do uh, the general gist of what you need. It takes only a couple of minutes. 
and only you know uh, pennies in terms of uh, or a couple of dollars maybe if you toss in some of the, the cross or something uh, but very inexpensive to make this costume all right hope you enjoyed the video and enjoy your costume